heard a wise person say, confidence is not will they like me. Confidence is I'll be fine even if they don't. I need you to pick your head up because right now your confidence is in shambles. But by the time I finish this conversation, your confidence is going to be on 10. Your confidence is going to be out of this world because you, my friend, are about to receive a self-confidence boost. The first thing I need you to do is destroy. And I mean, shut down the stinking thinking and the negative self-talk. Before you even get started, you're already talking yourself out of it. I can't do that. It can never happen for me. I'm telling you right now to your face, yes it can. You have to believe in you more than anybody else ever believes in you. That's your number one downfall. I need you to pick yourself up. I need you to get your head up high. And no matter what you're doing, believe in you. Because you can do it. You will do it. No matter what it is. Oh, I hear you. I hear you. And I understand. You have to operate in your gift, though. You really do. Because when you're operating your gift and you're doing things that you're supposed to be doing that come easy for you and hard for everybody else, that's when your confidence is at an all-time high. Like for me, if I'm rapping, I got massive confidence. But if somebody tells me to sing, that's not my gift. So I'll struggle with that a little bit. But here's the deal. Even if somebody asks you to do something that pushes you, that stretches you, those are not things that you have to measure yourself based on confidence. You measure yourself on whether you did it, whether you tried, whether you gave effort. And if you gave effort and you tried, that should give you all the confidence in the world to do the next thing. Another reason why your confidence is so shot is the people you're hanging around. I need you to reside in a positive atmosphere. I need you to reside in a confidence-built atmosphere. That means you got to hang with people that boost you up, that push you, that say, go you, go you, go you. It's kind of like, like when I'm watching Family Feud, right? And they ask the question. And somebody on one of the families gives the most silly answer, stupid answer, ain't no way it's going to be up on the board. But everybody on their team is like, great answer, great answer. Just boosting them, boosting their confidence. You need to hang around people like that, that are going to push you, that are going to boost you, that are going to give you all the confidence in the world. Because when you find self-confidence in yourself and those people that you're hanging around give you self-confidence, you're an unstoppable force and you walk with your head held high. You also got to celebrate the small wins. So you sat down and wrote out your plan, came up with your, your, your mindset and focus on the future of what you wanted to do. Along the way, you're going to have some turbulence, you're going to have some setbacks, you're going to have some failures, but also you're going to have some small wins. When you're driving 500 miles down the road, there are mile markers, one, two, three. You got to celebrate the small wins, every mile marker. When you achieve a small goal, remind yourself, I got that done. Yeah, I did that. Stick your chest out. Put your head up. That way you stay confident. Mile one, mile two, win three, win four. Before you know it, you are arriving at your destination of success, your destination of next level, your destination of the goal you set to achieve. Self-confidence all starts with you. So do yourself a huge favor and believe in yourself. Don't let fear or doubt creep into your system. Because remember, fear cannot live in a space that confidence occupies. So you are the one. You have everything in front of you. Your future is bright. You are a diamond. I just need you to walk with your head up and understand that no matter how you feel, self-confidence lives in you. And I just need you to share it with the world. And once you do that, you will find yourself climbing over the hump and making each and every day of your life a Wednesday. This is your self-confidence boost. And this is a great day to win.
Let's go.